The real story behind this viral picture. When this jaw dropping image first appeared on the internet, it quickly went viral. People all over the world were discussing this gaunt girl with the drastically changed face. Who was she? Why did she do this to herself? Were the rumors true that she'd surgically altered her face to look like her idol? But this wasn't the only picture she posted. Some very disturbing photos kept appearing online, showing a painfully thin young woman who had recently undergone severe plastic surgery. She was heavily bandaged around her nose, head, and hands. Her jawline looked freakishly altered, and her eyes looked sunken and artificially large. But that wasn't all. Surgery gone wrong. This mysterious woman had sharp, prominent cheekbones and very full lips. She stared at the camera with sad eyes and looked to be in a lot of pain from the procedures. Her shockingly thin fingers looked so fragile, and she appeared to be severely malnourished. It created such a stir on the internet, and people began asking why she would choose to do this to herself. She looked so unhappy and never appeared in any photos with friends and family. Lonely, craving to look like someone else and in pain. Surely this was no way to live. Was she trying to look like an actress? With her artificially blue eyes looking to the camera, several comments were made as to her slight resemblance to an A-lister Hollywood actress. From certain angles, it seemed that she was trying to alter her appearance to that of a well-known and sometimes troubled film star. Some people thought it was obvious who she was trying to morph herself into. Others could not make the connection. The online comments kept coming as the curiosity and fascination grew. Idol Obsession She kept releasing photos of herself, usually with bandages on her face, and she'd release a bit more information about herself with each image. She revealed that her name was Sahar Tabar, and she lived in Tehran, Iran. She explained on her Instagram account that she had undergone over 50 surgical procedures. So, who was it that she was trying to emulate? Actress Resemblance The stories began to come out in the press that the numerous operations had been done that she could look like the star of Tomb Raider and Mr. and Mrs. Smith. It was claimed that she was a huge fan and had long aspired to become a mirror image of Angelina Jolie. But things had obviously gone way too far. Botched Surgery Sahar told her many Instagram followers that mistakes were made during several of the procedures and that she was left with horrifically exaggerated features. Her lips ballooned and puffed up far more than she was expecting, and the shape of her nose was not what she wanted. Yet the images of her in a hospital bed kept appearing. Was she having even more work done? Horror under the knife Sahar, who was born and raised in the conservative and quite strict country of Iran, released photographic evidence showing the surgical changes that had been made. Iranian women usually didn't alter their physical appearance in this way, adopting instead to wear minimal makeup under their hijab and hide most of their delicate features. Yet here was a young woman who was choosing to stand out from the crowd with her extreme alterations. People were horrified to see the results. Instead of the smoldering film star look she was seeking, she resembled a ghoulish and unhealthy-looking woman. Each image would generate new followers and thousands of comments. It was normal for her to receive over 70,000 likes per photo. She was fast becoming an internet sensation. Media Attention Media websites and newspapers around the world began running features about Sahar, telling her story to more and more people. The images soon went viral as readers couldn't get enough of the freakishly transformed woman. But it wasn't just her over-exaggerated facial features that shocked them. It was the emaciated, gaunt body that gained their attention. Shockingly thin. The images showed Sahar's arms and hands looking painfully thin. She looked to be just skin and bones. Was she trying to replicate the ultra-thin look that Angelina Jolie had, following her drastic weight loss after her divorce from fellow film star Brad Pitt? Struggling to juggle the busy life of being a mother to six children, as well as directing the film First They Killed My Father in Cambodia, Jolie dropped to a worrying 76 pounds. It looked like Sahara had done the same. Was she seriously putting her health at risk in the name of idolization? Digging Deeper As more and more people read about the shocking story, they wanted answers. Had she really been that obsessed with Angelina Jolie? Was the plastic surgeon to blame? Why had she taken it to such an extreme?
and why had she been allowed to have so many procedures at such a young age? This tiny Iranian woman was in her early 20s when she started having the work done, as reports claimed. Far too young to do something that drastic, according to most people's comments and opinions. Too much, too young. Thousands studied the photos and scoured the internet for more information about this intriguing woman from Tehran. She was listed as being less than 5 foot tall and weighing only 80 pounds. As well as a facelift, she claimed to have had extensive Botox, rhinoplasty to change the shape of her nose, cheek sculpting and her jawline altered. When she posed for a picture, she would regularly pout to highlight the sharpness of her cheekbones and the fullness of her lips. Zombie, not Jolie. Comments flooded in from her Instagram followers and across the internet calling her a zombie and corpse bride after the character in the 2015 Tim Burton movie. Most of her comments were extremely negative. People were eager to find images of her appearance before the surgeon's knife had turned her into a caricature of Angelina. Wanting to please and appease her fans, Sahar released a pre-surgery photo and the reaction was huge. How could she have allowed herself to be permanently changed to this extent? Why did the surgeons agree to it? She used to look like a natural beauty and a happy young lady, but now she resembled a character from a horror movie. People were enraged, horrified and extremely opinionated. An incredible discovery. Why had this pretty Iranian woman taken such drastic steps to alter her natural beauty in an attempt to look like Angelina Jolie? When the truth was finally revealed, it was easy to see that there had been clues all along the way. It all started when Sahar posted the next photo online. The Telltale Signs If you study the image underneath, you'll see what many others saw. Digital Manipulations it was easy to see the distortions in the background, as well as blurred sections and elongated areas of the picture that looked out of place. Eagle-eyed people noticed odd angles of her arms and legs. In other photos, the furniture she was sitting on seemed altered. Something was definitely not right. All the evidence pointed to one conclusion. Image trickery in the form of Photoshop and heavy editing. The truth is finally revealed. Finally, Sahar confirmed to a Russian newspaper that she'd been doctoring the images and using heavy makeup. It had all been a hoax, and she had done it to amuse herself. Many of her online followers claimed they realized this from the beginning, whilst others had been genuinely taken in and worried about her mental well-being. Instagram fame Once the truth had been published, Sahar suddenly switched her Instagram account to private without an explanation. Prior to that, she had amassed a large following, with thousands frequently commenting on each newly uploaded image. She would caption each one with cryptic messages, such as, Do not be afraid to be different. Fear that you are like others. Some people who had been fooled by her art and had left messages that conveyed genuine concern. For example, Why would you want to look like this? You were perfect before all these changes. You were beautiful, but this… I don't even know what to say when you start getting older. I pray none of these changes affect your health. The artist speaks. Speaking about the altered photos, Tahar said, My fans know that this is not my real face. She assumed that people would realize that her ghoulish appearance and elongated limbs were all part of her artistic flair and creativity. She'd never wanted to look like Angelina, claiming to look like someone is not my goal. She'd insisted that she was merely expressing herself and goes on to say, Every time I publish a photo, I make my face more fun. It's a way of self-expression, a kind of art. My followers know that this is not my real face. Actual Surgery After much speculation, Sahara has since confirmed that she did have some plastic surgery, including liposuction, a nose job, Botox, and fillers on her lips. But she used makeup and digital trickery to achieve the majority of her freakish looks. She changed her eye color using contact lenses and dyed her hair different colors. Hostility and Harassment Sahar seems surprised at the hostility and negativity she's received since admitting the hoax. She feels that she should be entitled to self-expression and shouldn't be the target of online bullying. She says that she should be allowed to portray herself as she sees fit and was quoted as saying, I am my own muse. She'd never wanted to look like Angelina Jolie, even though she admires the actress immensely. But trying to resemble her in any way was never Sahar's aim. Natural Look 
Sahar has given the media outlets photos of herself as she appears today in an attempt to alleviate some of the backlash. It seems that some of those duped by this intriguing young lady from Tehran were not happy being the victim of a hoax. Today her Instagram account remains private and she keeps herself out of the spotlight. For now. What is she doing now? Sahar is keeping relatively low profile at the moment. She has over 6,000 followers on her Facebook account and uses her notoriety to raise awareness of important issues such as domestic violence, gay and lesbian rights, and political freedom. She adores her beloved Iran and wants the very best for its civilians. So perhaps in time she can change some of her haters into supporters and become known as someone other than the corpse bride.